All right, we're going to the swap and shop, yo. What makes today's drive a little bit different is uh, I've got an external camera, GoPro, uh, just behind the front wheels. I've got it taped on. So hopefully we don't have to do a recovery like we did with the uh, Merc a while back there. swap shop in a month or so. To assemble what I need to put the Studebaker back together, which mostly has to do with the exhaust manifolds. Turns out the exhaust manifold bolts I have are kind of stretched, or the threads are kind of fucker. So I'm gonna buy some uh, placements for those. Subscribers, subscribers may have noticed that uh, I've got a shit ton of nature videos up in the last three or four months. Really what that's about is, uh, <coughs> hey, I love nature, particular animals, but uh, B, um, I've not been, uh, I'm off cigarettes since uh, March 10th, I think it is. So that's a good four months now. Almost five months. And uh, next week will be five months. And also no beer or alcohol. Oh. So I've been trying to keep myself busy and uh, productive. And that's been going pretty good. I do notice me being more productive in general. And uh, taking a lot of video helps improve. <clears throat> Getting deep into summer now, so <coughs> I do want to get some car stuff done.
I used to do a lot of uh, hummingbirds and all that stuff. I've done it before. And uh, I've just been trying to get good at it. I've really just been uh, kind of leaving it up to chance. Yesterday I ran across that otter. I didn't know that was going to happen. But once I saw him down there, pretty much I knew what that video was about. So, I'm just trying to put myself in uh, lots of positions down by the beach or whatever where I can run across stuff like that that I wouldn't otherwise. This whole area is built up in big box and these used to be fields where we used to catch snakes. Then this uh, raceway was kind of out in the bush. Lots of new uh, people who live out here complaining about the raceway, all the noise. And the raceway's been here since the 50s, at least. Highly active since the 50s. It's a fucking Lamborghini. What's that doing here? at this gas station a uh, really hot 66 Valiant had been all fucking done up. It wasn't that black one that I see but uh, it was done up similarly like for drag racing. I was blown away the guy didn't pull over beside me. I was parked at the fucking gas station. He was just coming out. That would have been an excellent picture. And there's only so many uh, 66s out there. Trailer Park City, but uh, now it's all expensive housing. Lots of homes. again uh could have went and done a few laps in the, the go-karts there it's always hard to tell if that place is even open Thirty years since i rode go-karts That's the same uh, Maverick I saw it last time. I'm gonna go say hi to this dude. All right, there's nothing there for me today. <sighs> couple of lenses, couple of shitty cameras. No RC engines. Not very many good carpets. So. <clears throat> There's one interesting lens there, but I don't.
size of the aperture is essentially what you're getting there. There's that dude. Fuck. Over there. That's 66. I should follow this guy. Fucking idiot. You see that? He just strolls by me. Nothing to worry about. Fucking asshole. Fuck. Yeah, see, that's the. I can't. I can't make light of that bullshit. 